All right, let's see what we're doing. Use what you've learned to draw a picture of what you think the artist saw when he got home. I think he saw a house. So how to do that? Well, I guess I'll go east once. And then I'm trying to think here, east twice. And then north three times. Oh, I want to use that new block we saw. Oh, look at all these cool blocks. Uh, let's see. My house is going to be blue. Let's see. Oh, looking good. So I guess I won't go north three times because I saw, yeah, I want a roof. All right, reset. I should do this. We'll do that twice. And then we'll do this twice. <laughs> this is so cool. And then what would we do? Well, we're going to go south. Once. Oh, reset. South once and twice, and then I think east once and twice. <laughs> that is fun. That's my house. So, and honestly, this isn't great for a repeat because I'm only doing things two, two, two. Repeats are really good when you're doing things more than that. So let's say I wanted to have a... larger house, maybe I jump down here and have three in a row, then that's really good for a repeat. This not so much. Now I just kind of want to play around. What's pattern do? Mm, we'll do it. This side of the house will have a pattern. Which, ooh, let me try that. <laughs> awesome. Cool. This is fun. Loops are super important to code, or repeats are really important to code. From everything to making a character move, right? So a character's leg moves. So you have a repeat loop to show how much they're walking and how rapidly to running to selecting stuff on a menu. So I'm really glad we're learning this. Let's keep going.